Hi, I'm Sainer Inc. and today I'm here to review this Sennelier Aqua Mini set. I bought this when I was in Dublin. And this small travel set. And the price was 10 euros. Now this was quite cheap because I usually see this be much expensive, much more expensive. And this comes in this small tin. And here is eight colors, and this thing lifts off, and it came came with this small brush that is almost like almost useless because it's so short and it's not it really hurt my hand when I try to use this for a long time, and also this is very very small. And these colors are artist grade, and they are all light fasteners. And nice thing is there is package and there is all the pigment information and that's nice because not all the manufacturers do that. And the colors are a primary yellow, French vermilion, cinderios blue, French ultramarine blue, cello green light, sap green, burnt amber and paint grey. And here I have my swatch card with these colors. And I do my swatch cards on watercolor paper and I try to do try to do gradient gradient with them. Uh, primary yellow is really nice, like mid tone yellow. Then there's French vermilion, which is hue because it isn't really vermilion. Then there is Cinderella's blue and French ultramarine blue, two blues. But Cinderella's blue is mixed with Thalo blue and pigment white. I don't like white in my paint and this is opaque and it really easily makes mud if you mix it with other colors. And French ultramarine blue is ultramarine mixed with something, some violet pigment. I'm not quite a uh, fan of that thingy. I, I want to use pure, pure, yeah, pure pigment colors. Here is Taylor green light which is of course mixes and sap green and here you notice that this set has two greens, two blues, only one red and one yellow. I don't I don't know if this is more for landscape painters but I found this color selection quite not so great. I would rather have one green and have like a cool red because this set hasn't any cool reds. There is one uh, brown which is burnt amber and then there is uh, paint grey and I have here uh, cerulean blue, which is also a hue, because this is phthalo. This has phthalo and pigment white in it, and as you can see, it's, uh, uh, this schminke one is much more brighter. And here is ultramarine fine from schminke, and it's, I don't know, there isn't much difference between these. I use these in my sketchbook, because I find this is small set and it's best, best for traveling. I make this little red rose uh, with this, these red colors, and I don't, I didn't use the brush that came with the set. I use my water brush because this is much easier to use. And this isn't watercolor paper, so it doesn't look so great. And here's a little scene I made with that this set, and this is only used with the brush that came with the set, and I immediately noticed that. There's a problem to getting with smooth, uh, large washes because brush is so small, it's really run, of, run out of color really easily. I can show it. Let's take this green one here. Uh, this uh, wets quite easily. And if you want to see... Yeah, and that's the... It's all the wash you can do with this brush. Also, it's really annoying to hold. I tried to mix uh, some browns here and they work okay. Is But I find that there's really easy to get opaque mixes because that one blue is really opaque. And here are my uh, mix mixes that I made. I tried to mix skin colors. I used uh, 
Brown Tumper and French Mer Vermilion and little bit French Ultramar Ultramarine Blue because I like to use cool red when I mix my skin tones but because this set has no cool reds I couldn't use that. And then I try, try to mix green and it's quite decent with Cinderous Blue and Primary Yellow. Little bit muddy side because this has this white th thing in it. Uh, purple is really muted because there isn't cool red that you can use. You have to use this French Vermilion and French Ultramarine, but it isn't that it isn't bright. A primary yellow mix nice orange with red, and here I try uh, mix yellow and green and it make really bright bright thingies. And here I try to mix uh, this French Vermilion and Cinderous Blue, and I get this really nasty looking muddy thingy. So, I think this uh, set is good if you can get it with 10 euros, because it's really have this 8 artist Christ colors. Uh, some things that I don't like so much is... I have... Ah, here is it. Uh, the pans here are not these normal pans which have like this little plastic container that you can change easily. And here they are molded with this plastic, so you can take this off. But when this set was new, uh, this brown uh, came off, and I tried to fit it with this color, not no, because most half pans came with this way that they aren't just pop out. So, so if I pop this color out, I could put this color in, and it fit perfectly. So if you use this set, you can. Refill this with this. This is Sennelier pan. I didn't uh, try any other maker's pan. But uh, this uh, box with the came, there's really one big drawback, and it's this window. When I try to mix, I would much <laughs> rather have large, fat, flat, uh, wide surface here. But now I have this quite annoying window that is. And because it's plastic, it really beats up that this and these uh, emollient area here is really small. And that's really a bummer because it would be great travel boat if this has like palatine. And I would like see like um, divider here so you can make two different mixes. Of course, you can always pop this thing out and mix under here. And also I find this set could be smaller because there isn't anything here. This only goes halfway there, those pans. So you this could be much much thinner and then it would be even easier to travel with this. Uh, I've, mm, I don't like the color section and but the uh, colors are half decent. The color sele selection is only really bummer for me, but maybe this works better if you find just landscapes and don't need uh, violets and those colors. Uh, but I really recommend it and get some decent brush, not this, this one is horrible. And I think this could be a little bit longer because now the, the, I, can, I couldn't fit my travel brush here. But yeah, that was how, what I think of this set. As you can hear, I quite didn't like it, uh, but I, but because I got it with ten euros, it's really cheap and it's per uh, color. It's quite, it's not that much for other grade. So that's much my first review, and hope you like it and find it useful. See you in my next video. Bye.